Like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. Bird Box Barcelona 2023 Review Netflix Skies of Terror Bird Box Barcelona is a new Netflix horror film set in the apocalyptic world we got to know with the 2018 mega hit. Most of this story takes place in the post-apocalyptic world. Of course, with a few flashbacks to how it all started in Barcelona. No, lastly, to make sure we understand what kind of person someone was before the world changed forever. Dodd, I wasn't sure what to expect from it. And can T say I was impressed. Dot, I liked it though that we will face some language problems. As this is set in a city that attracts many tourists, it is not surprising that there are quite a few characters who do not speak Spanish. In fact, they do not even speak English a young German girl, which works really well. Read our Bird Box Barcelona movie review below. Available on Netflix worldwide starting July 14, 2023. Sure, it is fascinating to return to the world we got to know at the end of 2018. However, there is not much new. Or actually that is not true because the story contains new elements. Okay, okay, maybe I am just expecting too much or looking at way too many genre stories. However, I found much of the story in Bird Box Barcelona to be fairly predictable, from the plot twists which were very clearly hinted at and hinted at early on to the selfish characters we know from every great apocalyptic horror story. While we all know that the instinct to survive can be fight or flight for most, one might think that the groups formed in this Barcelona story have developed a certain form of trust. I couldn't quite imagine how easily some were deceived and others surprised by those they trusted. For me, this would have worked much better if the story had been played in the early days after the creatures arrived. The star of this particular bird boxing story is Mario Casas. He is someone many will recognize, especially if you've seen some Netflix genre reproductions. He will no doubt be a familiar face. Most recently, he starred in the Netflix series The Innocent. Before that he...